After all this time to believe in Jesus, after all these drugs, I thought I was him. After all my lying, crying, and suffering, I ain't good enough, I ain't clean enough to be him. No, no, after all these years. Budget! Ah, uh, so. Ah, uh, so. Ben, Ben, Ben. My man, his name is Ben, Ben. What's going on, folks? Wyatt, Chris. So, what the hell? Hey, Kyle. So, let's go live, man. Let's go live. Before tonight's broadcast, I actually ran and got a jelly donut and a large decaf. A little bit too much um, coffee today with our, you know, with all, all our snow and everything, really, you know what I'm saying. Yes, it's a great bag, man. I should have brought my laptop down here, man, to show you what I'm going to do. Ba -boo -boo -boo. What's up, Alistair or Lester? Oh, what's up, man? R. Lester, first time I've seen you on, man. 1977, RY23. Robert Matthews. Aluka Finn. Oyuzama. Abdu. What's up? Yeah, you know what? Actually, I was there this morning also. Also. And uh, the kids wanted up here $1.99. Any size hot cocoa. And I saw that they had like. Frappuccino or Almond Joy flavors too, man. But oh, awesome, Skylar. Yeah, these have been. I don't know what the regular price is. Last year, they. This is from last year. This has been sitting for a year, man. Um, I never got to it for some reason. I think I forgot I had it for a couple months. Then I decided. Well, I think I wait. Yeah, you know what? We gotta. Man, this 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 website stunk stinks on this phone. I can't take it anymore, man. We gotta bring the. I think I got that Milwaukee because my buddy has one. I think I've talked about it plenty of times, but he uses it for everything but tools. And I think I mentioned it a few times. Yeah, not too bad. I I don't know. We might have got three inches top, Sebastian. It's weird because it snowed for a long time, and it was coming down. But I don't know, man. Very weird. Like three inches. I mean, by the time the sun came out this morning, I mean, it was pretty much, you know, gone. Oh, budget tools. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, hey, just like all these other channels that get, you know, some of this stuff. Lots of batteries. Actually, I can, uh, I got to give one to 94 GT Coupe. Uh, Makita, I gotta find. I don't know if I have a three amp hour, man. You got Texas. Clint, what's up, buddy? Toby, Coco, Beantown Boy. All right. We got some snow in Texas a few days ago. Austin, wow. Yeah, I was expecting a little more, but I think it did enough damage that leaf season's probably done. Because it's going to be brutally cold. What workbench do I got? I built this myself, uh, 1977. I actually have a video, one of my first videos of me showing you how to make this for like 70 bucks. So go look it up. Um, our city shut down. How many inches did you get? Hey, Art Garcia, what's up? Yeah, man. I was in a depot. I don't know, probably nine months ago, and it was out. Was it? No, actually, it couldn't have been nine months ago. A few months ago, and we looked at it again. This pops in and out of stores for some reason. It's and now they have like a new one. Uh, but I still think this one's the best. Um, I saw the other one. I don't know where I saw it. Maybe on Instagram, somebody might have had the new. This one is the best, um, feature-wise, you know. But I don't know. This thing has never been open, so I say let's crack her freaking open. One inch, and the whole city closed down. And they, this is the brushless impact. 
Again, this is not the fuel. This was their first brushless impact um, driver before the fuel came out. They went to the brushless. And it's funny, now DeWalt, you know, they have the XR. But they just came out with a non-XR brushless. Kind of weird, right? But yeah, so this is the kit. Your, it comes with a... this And guys, this was 149 bucks. Um, that was the reason I got it. I got it for content, to be honest with you. And I, and I wanted the backpack. Um, but now I actually really need it. So, um, yeah, this was 149 I have a lot of videos talking about it last year. You know, before I started doing all these deals for you guys and all that stuff. Um, uh... I'm trying to read. Man, they come up so quick, I lose them. But do it was nah, they don't send doubles, bro. I wish. I want another string trimmer. Um, I just got the dual XR, love it. Oh, best tech. Jeez, that's a steal. Yeah, the backpack, like I said, it's ranged from like $59 to $79. I saw it at $99. I have no idea what it is now. If one of you great people who are on tonight wants to look that up and tell the people what it is. Hey, Rotary Dan. Rotary Dan, my man from Instagram. Um, Sebastian, what's up, bud? Yeah, we're going to open her up. All right, so this is what you got in this kit. Again, 149 last year. Got the brushless impact. All right, you got... Uh, some shockwave um, kit here. Some sh a shockwave bit set. You got the backpack. And you got the dual charger. That's right. You got the dual charger. And you got probably a 1.5 amp hour battery. And this tells you all the bits that are... Man, this is bad focusing tonight. I'm sorry. All right, Hunter, it's good seeing you, buddy. Yeah, it comes with some good stuff. You got some Torx. You got some squares. You got some Phillips. 18-piece uh, bit set it came with. Uh, 1,500 inch-pounds, 3,600 impacts per minute. Uh, I know 94 GT Coupe. A lot of you guys took advantage of this... Um, impact driver kit over depot $99 and it's still going on I was just there uh, my last video from depot we looked at this it's still 99 bucks um, I'd probably go with this over to Makita maybe it's very close guys I don't know I'd say Makita then I would say Milwaukee I don't know both very good tools you know the reason why you give the edge to Milwaukee a little bit longer warranty um, I don't know if that one does 3,600 impacts per minute. It's crazy. Uh, 1,500 inch pounds. I think the Makita might be 1,460 on that one. Again, might be 1,500. One or the other. All right, so let's open up. So what's the newest fuel brushless 18 volt impact? The newest one? Tool boss. What's the newest fuel brushless 18 volt impact? Yeah, the fuel. There's only been one generation fuel. I. It's the same one. They might have changed. Ah, that's a tough one there. I don't know if there's kind of... I know they came out with the Milwaukee Fuel, obviously, impact after this brushless... Um, or, uh, this Actually, the Fuel might have came out before this. I'm, they were about you know the same time. I'm thinking this one came out first. But I know they kind of updated that um, Fuel impact... But I think it's pretty much same specs and all that. So, yeah, that would be the new one. Uh, what is it? The 2747 something. Milwaukee 2 3 amp for 119 at the depot. Yeah. After all this time. I should have got, like, damn tripod for this man I don't know why I put myself through this 
I gotta get a tripod as soon as I'm done here. Any of you guys know a good tripod comment? A good, like, tripod. I'm sick of doing everything with one hand, man. I'm a two hand, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I hope people took advantage of this big deal there last year, man. I mean, this was a good deal. 149, man. Yeah. 149. So let's really look hard inside here, man. I mean, look what do we got going on. I mean, wait, well, let's take out the Milwaukee light and see what's going on in there. I mean, it looks pretty good. Plenty of room up top. You know? Oh, try it yet. Yeah. What's up? Tony! Yeah, man. I know everybody who's new, Tony. And I know you're new. Thank you for joining. Miguel, hey! Thank you, buddy, Miguel. Yeah, come. Uh, this is the backpack. This is the backpack, backpack, backpack. Everything should be in this backpack, backpack. Was body uh, and it's all that golden crossbow. See you all. Ah! Talk amongst yourselves for another five seconds, but when we come back. Live, we're gonna have a surprise. We're gonna have a surprise. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, all county snow pros. I saw, I commented on one of your pictures there, man. Is, are those your trucks? Oh, is that like the town? Is, I mean, there were some big trucks. I commented, man. Not your Fords. I think you have Fords there. But you had like these big, big trucks. All right, so again, I, I you might be able to find this kit somewhere. Um, if I can come across it, if any of you guys know, I mean, I don't know what they charge for it now. This was last year's um, Home Depot's kind of Christmas. I don't know if anyone else was selling this. I don't know if like, you know, Tool Barn and... CPO was uh, selling this kind of stuff, but um, or Ohio Power Tool. Did you ever see that? I've never seen a company with more negative reviews. I don't know what they're putting bombs in the stuff that these people order or something. I was like, man, I can't put these people on my channel. I was gonna work with them affiliate. I went on and checked out their website and I was like, man, this is like bad. But uh, let me take a look. And I, I Googled it and it was like 2.4 rating on them. Um, and um, I was like, all right, I'm, I'm, I'm not doing that. Ohio Tools or something. Thank you, John Gonzalez. Toby. Oh. Sebastian has a ultra compact and lightweight aluminum tripod 360 panorama. What's up, Nightbird? Get it Tuesday. All right, I'm going to check that out. All right, so once you uh, crack open this bag, and the planet formed. Yeah, golden cross. It's on Amazon. Thank you, Sebastian. I mean, real thick nylon here. Um, you know, like I said, it's not the first time I've shown it. Um, I've always talked, wow. Look at this, wow. Really soft straps. Man, home run. 
we got all these um, compartments here. Again, we're going to try to fit some stuff in there and see what it, we can get in there a little bit. We'll see what we got inside the bag, the goodies that came with it. A Space Age love song. And Planet Pong. All right, so uh, yeah, man, looking good, man. All right, so you got the Milwaukee logo stitched in, nice white. You got a red, black uh, color scheme here. Some real nice thick nylon. Got a handle up here. There's 94. I talked about you three times today, 94. And you stroll on 15 minutes late. We have some contract with municipalities as a sub to take care. Okay. So you just use their equipment. What's up, Joey Gamer? Hector Lara, what's up, man? Hector's been a long time watcher. All right, so up to five times more durable, the job site backpack 48-228200. We got the impact resistant base. We'll look at that limited lifetime warranty on the job site backpack. Uh, 1680 ballistic material, tear resistant or tear resistant department still we actually bought no yes oh they are your the big ones all right and i know you had some big fords there but then you had the big monsters with the saw i commented on the video man <laughs> you know he could bring this to school as his book bag my my son he'd be the coolest thing around and I'll tell you, wow, that's awesome. Hey, all County, good for you, man. You got a serious gig going there, man. You also got another handle here. And here you got two. Some real heavy-duty zippers with the Milwaukee logo again on it. Real nice bag. Um, you know, ballistic. Um, yeah, exactly. I mean... It's pretty good. No go around here. Gang colors. Red? Red and black? No, just red. It's not all. It has to be all red. 94 GT. I mean, that's like saying if it was blue and black, you can't wear it. Or is red and black a gang thing? I don't know. Uh, yeah, like I said, 1680D ballistic material. Um, so it's tear resistant. Uh, again, we got the lifetime warranty. Load bearing harness. Oh wow! So you can connect it there. Nice, Kevin Barrett. Um, I'm trying to get. I think 94 GT Coupe's gonna look up the price of this. Again, Kevin, if you you might have came in late. This was the kit last year for 149 dollars. Uh, it's a 352 dollar value. They were giving this away. This is from last Christmas season. And I want to say I got it in November. I'm sorry, it went dead on me there. Send me to Columbia, please. Oh, am I back on? Only the bag. $17.99. I keep going on and off here. Sorry. Never seen Bloods rocking a power drill. <laughs> All right. So, um, again, you got the uh, load-bearing harness. $89 for just the bag. I've seen him, I think for 59 was the lowest I've seen him. I think they're regularly 79. Um, again, these these comments come on so quick. That 87.99, uh, Zach Coon, is that Home Depot or is that at like, you know, CPO or something? All right, this job site has 35 pockets. And I'm going to update you on it, of course. Okay, it's at Home Depot. All right, cool. Um... This guy's climbing up a ladder with his backpack on. Hard bottom base. I'll show you that in a second. High contrast interior. You can easily find your items with the uh, contrast. What's up, Charlie? 79 here in Texas for R. Garcia. Would you get the 275718 volt? Surge. Yeah, I get the surge for 129. I it could be the best impact. 
I'd say it's the best impact. Top three impacts out there. Possibly number one that I've used. Rugged metal zippers, we talked about that. The load-bearing harness, even distributes weight, padded, and breathable. Sternum strap, we talked about that. Attachment strap. Oh, cool. See, so you can kind of put... Oh, wow. You could put on some vertical handles. Water bottle pocket for your favorite beverage of choice. Front bulk pocket holds full-size fish tape. And right here is your the contrast you can kind of see, but 35 organizer pockets. Yeah, this is really cool. You know, this is something that if you invest in, uh, we talked about all that. Um, you know, you could really have this for a long time, if not your whole life. Now, again, not saying it ain't going to tear. It says tear resistant. If you use it, it gets wet, you know, just wear and tear. I mean, I could see people who are heavenly using this start beating it up after like a year. But you got that limited lifetime warranty. I don't know. You know, it doesn't mean, it doesn't say full lifetime warranty. It says limited. So, you know, they're not going to cover just wear and tear on it, you know. But it's good that they do offer um, a nice little warranty with it. All right, so that's the bag from the outside here. We're going to look at the impact and, um, you know, uh, that goody stuff. But, you know, I'm just trying to kind of, maybe we'll see what we got here. Well, this is a big one. This one you're not going to get in there. All right, let's see what we can do. All right, so let's open her up. Uh, let me show you the bottom. Again, uh, the back. Really nice padded back here. I mean, just hope you can see this. You got the nylon kind of here. So this is kind of what's around the entire book bag. Or book bag. Uh, job site backpack. Um, and then here are some comfort points. This is some softer um, cotton slash nylon. Uh, material that's definitely cushioned and softer uh, to lay up against your back. Eagles just won. They beat who was quarterback? Was Nick Foles playing Nathaniel? I know that Carson Wentz got hurt. When I was getting my cup of coffee, the broadcaster said Carson got hurt. Well, what really counts is in around another, what, 35 minutes when the Steelers start. Mm. Tom Brady is a is a Mary. He's a Mary. Whoa, 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 Tom Brady is a Mary. What can you say? Again, really soft straps. Did you ever check out that? No. I um posted something on it, but I didn't I don't have it. You can take this apart. This is um and you got the Milwaukee logo on the straps also, which is cool. I just took that off. You can put these any way you want. If you're a bigger dude, you know, you can, uh, if you're a smaller dude, you can tighten them any way you want. Here is uh, the bottom. Again, Milwaukee logo. Let's flip her around. I mean, just a really nice bag, guys. That's all I can say about it. And uh, you got the Milwaukee logo in black on the front also. But look at that. I mean, it sat in that box for a year, and it's just beautiful mint. Looks like they put a nice shine on this with some kind of lacquer. Some some lacquer. Nice small packet on the bottom with, in it. Yep. How much is the whole thing with the Joe? This was $149. Uh, last year was one of the deals, man. Uh, they ran it for a pretty long time. Um, <clears throat> uh, now it's $79 to $89. It depends on who you ask or what part of the, the country you're in. But I don't think you can find this anymore. You might be able to find it on, I don't know, one of the tools. I don't know, maybe eBay or something. But 
Again, this was last year's uh, Milwaukee did this goodie, the little goodie. Mm, it's in the front. Oh, wow. Whoa, back up. Back up. Let me get a sip of some coffee for this one. Wow. They have a few of those bags at my Home Depot. Yeah, I've seen them in and out. Like I said, I think three months ago, I was in the Home Depot during a live video, and they had one right in the center of the showcase, and we we looked and talked about it for a good five minutes. Uh, but a lot of people are asking about this kit. I haven't seen this kit, though, again, and I don't know if it'll ever come back. Oh, wow. And this is like another compartment here. I mean, this is great for, I mean, you know, your your pens and your pencils and your saws all, the, the ink saws, excuse me, saws all, yeah. You know, you could put your knives in here, you know, stuff you don't really want to, you know. Again, I'm going to put some stuff in here just to give you some ideas. You know, we'll put maybe a nice pen in there. So, you know, I don't have my, my ink saws. But we're going to talk about that in a second. Yeah, it's nice. Alright, so, uh, whoa, what do we got here? Added protection. And, oh my God. Look at her butt. And baby's got back. Never seen the kit, but seen that bag. When you had posted about it was the last time. Yeah. Ah, uh, man. I don't even know when I did that with this, this kit video. Um, not Milwaukee. Yeah, he's playing around, Joey Gamer. EGM, I get... Uh, the Milwaukee stuff at Harbor Freight. All right, so you got plenty. You know, it's funny. Well, this is a smaller one than the one I got here. Yeah, this is a nice little 18-piece Shockwave um, Impact Duty fit set. Uh, obviously, a little bit smaller than this one. This is like, I'm telling you, this is like the Generation 1. Um, yeah, this is like the Gen 1. You see how it's still silver? You can't find that anymore. They're usually red or black. But this is a year old, so I don't know. Yeah, these are even red, man. These are even red. I'll tell you, I like this ad adapter, man. I didn't like it at first. Again, you really have to give things time um, or really work use it. You know, I, I, I played around with it there. I'm like, eh, I don't know if I, I... I really like this one. It's really magnetic. Um, I really like it, yes. Yo, TB, what's up? Carlos. What's the mount on the back for this? This right here? You can screw it on some of these belts. You can screw it. Wow, you got some nice ones in here. Even my kit, well, I got a couple, but these look definitely, um, these are a newer set. All right, I don't want to spend too much time on that. Um, so you did get that with it, which is probably a good 10 or $15 value. Oh, uh, Atom Micah 92, it's 215 on Amazon. It's still available. All right, so I'll put the link below uh, if it's still up there when I get done with the video. If uh, someone wants to consider this, I tell you, even a two fifteen, it's not bad. I mean, I don't know. The one forty nine was uh, was a great deal. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. <laughs> yeah. Now, John, no way, man. This is all. Besides, this was a year ago. Milwaukee and DeWalt. Yeah, I get all this stuff now. I don't pay a day. Boss, you cut out early. I'm sorry. What you sorry, man, about. Oh, no problem, Jay Collins. Yeah. Well, that's 
You can get it now if you want, but you're going to have to leave my show, Zakoon. And they ain't leaving my show to go buy anything. Thank you, Sebastian. Yeah, so you got some nice deep pockets and everything. Uh, we talked about the pocket here. We talked about... Oh, this is nice. <laughs> yeah, so, you know, you can kind of... Um, these are great. Um, you know, for the pliers and stuff. Oh, you can't even see. Sorry, guys. But, you know, you could set it up any way you want, really. Um, here's the impact, which we'll uh, check out. Man, this is nice, man. Two fifty with sixteen shipping on Amazon. Oh, that's that's in England now. Sears used to have a Craftsman backpack. I was gonna buy it, but I haven't seen them anymore. I've seen it too. I think I saw it when I was doing the Amazon video. Check Amazon, EJM. Joey Gamer has this impact. Wow, I like it, man. Oh. You got to get this. Guys, you got to get this, man. Wow, this is so small and light. Wow. We'll have to do a review on this one real soon. Because I'm just in love. See, this is the stuff I like. I don't like the top of the line. I like the kind of stuff that comes out of nowhere and kind of can surprise some people. And, you know, it was thrown in with this backpack set. Job, job site backpack kit. And now it's offered for 90 It was 119 Now it's 199 Uh, $99. Very small, R. Garcia. Yep, I know my man, 94GT, bought it. He had it on Instagram. I commented. I love him. Um yep 16 2750-20 16 this was uh, 94 GT what are we looking at here the 33rd week of 2016 so nice it already has the uh, belt clip on it. You can obviously take it off, put it on the other side if you want. Again, it's a pretty straightforward um, impact driver. Yes, it does have a brushless motor, but you don't have any speed settings or anything. But, you know, with impact drivers, uh, I mean, they're nice to have, but, I mean, not too much really of a big deal. Uh, impact wrenches, big time. It means a lot. It was a big addition to the impact wrench platforms is when they were able to put these different settings on with the impact drivers like i said it's nice to have and you know could definitely help people in certain times but not too much of a big deal atomica 92 i'll buy the whole thing off you boss do you think of the surge i love oh i'll be getting a lot of surge questions yeah I, like i said it's Probably the best impact driver out there, man. Uh, again, my man Joe Montague made a good point about the, the Makita. Again, a lot of people don't think of the Makita um, pulse driver too much because they just don't, they didn't really advertise it. They really didn't market it well. Um, a lot of people don't even know it exists. Uh, but I've heard a lot of good things about that, but, you know, I haven't used it. Um, you know, uh, gun to my head, I think the three best impact drivers, okay, on the market, I would go the Surge, I'd go the 8, 8, 7, the Walt, and then you're going to really, it's not really that powerful, okay? It's not that powerful. All right? And I can't include the Makita stuff because Makita doesn't, you know, I'm, I'm not 
I don't really, I'm not, I don't work with them. I'm not sponsored. They don't, you know, so I don't work with a lot of their stuff too much anymore. I love that Bosch IDH182. It's a socket ready impact driver, 1650 inch pounds of torque. Okay. Makita Impact, Mike K. Yeah, I do like them. And if you watch my channel, Mike, you can go through all my videos, and I'd say my favorite. But I don't, I don't, I don't play with them too much anymore. So I don't really know what's going on with a lot of their latest uh, impacts, man. I mean, I'll be honest with you. The last Makita tool I bought was probably that radio, and it was like forty nine dollars. So I don't, I don't really do too much Makita anymore. So, it's tough. I have the Bosch IDH. Yeah, you know what it is? And I, and believe me, the fuel and the DeWalt... You know, listen. The Bosch, power-wise, doesn't compete with the Milwaukee fuel or the 887 by DeWalt. Um, the Surge is, is, you know, it's different. It's not... A, it's a speed... Um, it's a speed drill, impact drill. You know, you don't want to say impacts. It's not really, it doesn't, it doesn't impact. But we'll call it an impact driver just for this little talk here. But, uh, 1800. Yeah, so it's not, and to be honest with you, the Bosch at 1650, um, it doesn't even feel that powerful, to be honest with you. But it's definitely powerful. It's got great speed settings, and I love the comfortability of it. Real thin handle. And again, you can throw half-inch sockets on it like nothing. Um, I would love to see them come out with an update to that. A little bit more power. And it would be just a bomb. And what I'm really surprised about was how come Makita, Milwaukee, DeWalt have not come out with that truck? I mean, that thing is... Uh, I, what? You cr Maybe they don't want to hurt their impact wrench sales i don't own any mccall yeah 885 is a great impact too buddy it's just an old kevin it's old it's been around for six seven years it's old it's brushed very small compact 1400 inch pounds of torque you know in this day and age with 1850 and 2000 the the rigids the new ryobi the new ryobi the new ryobi 2200 inch pounds man so the 1400 to wall but yeah the bosch is great all right let's i'll be here all day if uh we don't look at this so you got a battery in here you can stick your battery in, in these pockets man and maybe what we'll do, we're trying to stick some battery. Yes, the 1.5. So you could put a 1.5, probably a 2 amp hour. They're pretty much the same size. I got a hunky dory one. I'm going to try to put this on after all this time to believe in Jesus. After all these drops. You can stick the batteries like this to 12 volts. I wouldn't recommend that. Uh, I'm sure we can find a better spot for it. Um, I'm sure you can kind of work these in here. But you can fit your 18 volt. Um, your 12 volt. Again, there's a whole other side here. That we got to get into. But I'm not going to take the charger out. You guys know what the dual charger looks like. So, um, pretty simple. So, yeah, so again, you got some compartments here. Whoa. The bottom's hard plastic, R. Garcia. You missed it, man. Nathaniel Bradley, should I sell? I don't know. Someone was saying that the SDX is done. They're not making it anymore. So was just a one-year deal. Uh, here's the pen light. Obviously, you can stick in the bigger flashlight if you want. Also, that can also be done. Uh, um, and here is my Milwaukee 
and this, you know, instead of carrying this around, this also charges your 12 volt batteries. Uh, if you're going to go strictly 12 volt, you don't need, um, you know, you don't need this big charger to charge your 18 volts. Obviously, you're not going to carry it. You can charge them with this. Um, again, you could put it on the side here, you know, I think. These are mostly for screwdrivers and stuff like that and, and, and wrenches and stuff. And you could stick stuff in here. You know, if, uh, I mean, there's all kinds of crap. You can stick some paint brushes in there if you're a little painter. Or if you're a plumber, you know, for your glues and stuff. All right, so, again, we'll leave that in there. Let's get to the big part. Now, this is where the laptop go. Oh, laptop. All right, this is, like, for your laptops and stuff like that, this section here. Um, you know, this is where you can throw some stuff if you're not carrying that. Um, you know, if you go to their website, they have, uh, I mean, you can kind of see a little bit of it here. Yeah, like I said, a lot of the screwdrivers, uh, your pliers and stuff, and your snips. I own Gen 1 M12, you know, if any Home Depot is selling the 52 Husky, yes. Jasmine, I, my, the video I just did. See you, boss, like 116. Okay, thank you, buddy. Yeah, J Jasmine, I just did uh, a live video when they had them. They were setting them up. I think they're 249 or uh, 199 I can't remember. Uh, yeah, so, again, if you're not going to use this, like, for your laptop, I mean, you can use it for other stuff. I mean, you can fit other stuff in here. I'm sure I'll be putting some... You know, I'll have all my business cards and my doorknob flyers and, you know, all my my little notepad with my, with my laptop. Um, you know, I'm probably not going to use it. You know, I'll have, like, the basics. Maybe I'll have a flashlight in there, maybe a drill. But I'm not going to be carrying all kinds of different screwdrivers. You know what? I, I'll probably maybe, I think I'll get put my Wera multi-tool um, screwdriver, multi-use, you know, got like 16 different bits in there, but, you know, definitely you could put your, uh, uh, you know, your drill, this is geared for the electrician, you know, mainly, um, but, you know, a lot of different, uh, trades can use something like this, and comment, uh, I love how you guys comment, and, uh, tell us about what you use them for and all that, you got a nice little area in here, Again, you can kind of put some batteries in here. Now, what it with this is um, yeah, this is a little storage area also. You, know, you also got a little compartment in here. Wow, it's pretty big actually. I mean, it's so big. It's so big. Um, I don't know about that. Oh, but you also got a spot in the front for some other uh, screwdrivers. Again, it's with one hand. It's just I'm gonna, I'm gonna put you, I'm gonna put you down, man. Please don't be mad at me. Don't be mad at me. You know you don't wanna be mad. Don't be mad. So you can put a couple screwdrivers up here too. Um, you probably want to put some smaller ones in here. Uh, not that this is big, but um, so you got a lot of places for some screwdrivers. Over 35 different uh, compartments. Uh, like I said, in here you can throw all kinds of silly stuff, man. You want to put your bits. This is a great place to put your bits, especially if you're like, because you know you're gonna you're using them all the time. So instead of opening your bag every time, you kind of can have them ready here. Um, you know, all kinds of different stuff. You know, you can do whatever you really want. Um, oh, I just lost my glasses. Hold on. So uh, yeah, this is the job site backpack. Um, really well made guys. I have the Husky backpack and it's got three compartments and a pocket on the outside. It's pretty good. It's like 60 bucks. 
you know, that's what I'm saying. For 60 bucks, you get the Husky. Again, I'm sure it's probably, you know, built fairly to the same specs, but this is like 79 bucks. And again, you got to remember, this was $59 at least two or three times last year. Yeah, well, that would be great, Rick. Yeah, buy some shirts. And um, with the $4 free shirt, I'll, I'll buy a backpack and we'll give one away, man. That'd be great. The new Impact Driver 12 is available. Uh, it's not available yet, John. Uh, it's on the website. You might be able to pre-order it. I don't think it's going to be available till January 1st, according to some of the websites. But this was a slam dunk deal, guys. Uh, it was 45 minutes. The Steeler game is starting. Remember, you got an 18 uh, piece shockwave bit set. You got a two uh, 1.5 amp hour battery. You got a brushless impact, which I'm really excited, man. I'm just excited for this. I always knew I kind of had it, but I, I, then I forget. But I'm going to put this up against... I have every generation now, obviously. We'll, we'll have the brushed, we'll have the brushless, and we'll have the fuel. And we'll see uh, how this does. But I like the size of it. You know, you got to remember, even the brushed impact driver... Uh, the oldie, uh, but one of my favorites. I must have 10 videos, 15 videos on it. I have it destroying the new Bauer. Yes, a six-year-old impact destroying that Bauer. That one's probably the same. They're not big. And I'll be honest with you, the fuel's probably a little bit thinner than this one. But this looks exactly like the brushed version, except for this. It looks exactly the same, so I'm a big fan. That's my favorite brushed impact driver of all time is Milwaukee's. I'll be honest with you. And my favorite impact driver, well, my second, one of my favorites was the fuel. And so, I, you know, you guys, I'm on the Walt, you know, the Walt's been kicking some butt this, this holiday season. And this season, they've been coming out with some really good stuff. But the 887, I always liked the feel of it. But I didn't. I didn't own it until they sent me their new Tool Connect uh, 888, not the 887, the 888. Um, and I got to play with that a little bit, and that is just an amazing impact. Hey, Coppin, what's up, buddy? Hey, Camaro 630HP, thank you, man. Real nice guy. My dad is putting on the game on now. Cool, man. Yeah. Oh, it's the pregame starting. Hey, R. Garcia, thanks for coming in. I'm going to watch Dunkirk. <laughs> mm -hmm. What do you think the score is going to be tonight? How many sacks are they going to get in Flacco? Flacco. That's good to hear, uh, A. Coppin. Just switched from Cold Ball 24 volt because my Lowe's wasn't honoring the warranty. Switched to Rigid. What do you think about them? Yeah, they're all right. You know, comparable to Cobalt, I think they're about the same. I was actually going to get Cobalt. Now that you don't like them, again, a lot of you guys... See, that's what I spend my money on uh, now, is getting stuff that you guys want me to check out. Um, you know, and eventually, we'll start... You know, we got a couple... Good, you know, this will be going away next week. Well, not next week, two weeks. But... You know, again, talking about a lot of people have still brought up the, uh, what's that called? The Patreon. I'm not, I, I can't do that. I, I, I never, I don't feel, I mean, I would feel like such a schmuck. All right, guys, you're going to send me money every month just so you can watch me. Yes. So I can't do that. But, um, oh, yeah. So, yeah, I got 57 of you on here. So, yes, very true, Jay Collin. The rigid batteries are terrible. Horrible. Kills the whole platform. I always forget to mention that. Thank you, Jay Collin. But I'm sure Jay Collin is mentioning, I'm mentioning that because I probably said it around 50 times. Yeah, that's a real killer. And you know what's real funny? You know, I talk about it a lot. Rigid announced their 6-amp hour and their 9-amp hour Bluetooth batteries 
July of 2016, and they were supposed to come out around Christmas of 2016. Now we're at Christmas 2017, and they're still not out. So that just tells you the 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 the, the engineers are there. Somebody is really dropping the ball over it rigid. Yeah, it's a great bag. It's a nice bag. You know, for $79, I'd really consider it. At $59, I'd jump on it. Because, again, it's big. You really got a lot of room in here. And, again, um, it's very versatile. I mean, you can use it for so many different things. You know, for you know my uh, buddy who I talk about, his wife puts the baby formula in these in these pockets. She's got freaking baby food in here. You know, he's got Snicker bars in there. He uses it. He bought this kit. This is the kit he bought. I told him about it, and he bought it because he needed an impact. And he doesn't play with. He don't know anything about tools. So he got the bag, and he's his wife take took it over on him. But you got spots. I mean, you got a lot of spots on it, and it's really a nice, durable bag. Um, Ariel, what's up? Red is good. I have a tax exempt at Home Depot and could give you my number to save on. Oh, very. That's nice of you, Camaro. Nah, it's not a big deal, man. I'm not, you know. I think we got enough stuff here to cover. Uh, I want to start doing updates on some of this stuff, too, you know. Um, we got a lot of content we can do. Milwaukee's sending me some stuff shortly, and hopefully DeWalt will be. Bosh, like I said yesterday, uh, Miss Rachel Klein is just, you know, the, Bosch needs to work on their social media, and that's another reason why they're falling. They don't have the right people in charge of their social media. You understand what I'm saying? The man Jim, who I worked with, was fantastic. But he must have got promoted because he did a good job. Looks like it would make a nice camera. Yeah, good, it's good. Got a cop and good point. You know, camera bag or whatever. Yeah, I'm I'm done with it. Jay Collins A10. Um, I just got to edit it, and this week it'll definitely be up. Thank you so much for all those likes, guys. That really means a lot to me. Wow, I just looked. But that's about it, guys. I I want I know you guys like these unboxings. Again, this is my first time looking at it really also. I do that with you just so we can spend time talking, answering questions, having a great time with a cup of coffee. Um, I will test this out. We'll do a review of the uh, 2750. It's been long overdue. Um, we'll put it up. You know, this winter, once I get that trailer, I'll have this whole section cleared and hopefully organized a bit and I'm gonna kind of set up a nice indoor face-off duel and and you know um, well I got a lot of projects I want to do I might even be able to fit my shed in here and kind of finish it indoors I need to get a heater in here uh, you know this isn't really a great you know my goal is to have a you know my man Chris Jones, I don't know where the hell he is. I haven't seen him. If anyone's heard from Chris Jones, call your local police department. Um, but he has like a 15 by 20. I don't like it connected. I don't want it separate, man. I want electric. I want solar panels. I want it so I can live in that thing. The wife's a pain in the ass. I'll stay in the goddamn workshop. Where are you getting your trailer, boss? Probably tomorrow. It's done. It's paid for. I was supposed to get it on Thursday. They never called me. Friday, I wasn't going to get it because I was too busy. Saturday, I was going to go, but obviously the snow. And um, hopefully tomorrow. So. I feel you. Yep. 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 Food heater. Frozen walkway. What's up, buddy? The hand of the boss in the video. Oh, it is? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> All right, people. All right, let me get out of here. And watch the Steeler game. Thank you for coming on. Good to be got to work. All right, Andy, take it easy. Logan, take getting more snow on Tuesday. You getting more? I don't know about that. 
I haven't been following the weather. I got to really... I don't think so. I know it's supposed to be brutally cold. What's up, Darian? It's supposed to be really, really, really... I mean, Jasmine, they're, you got your batteries are warranted for life. Uh, they're LSA. I hear a lot of bad stories about the LSA. Um, supposedly, it, honoring it isn't that big of a deal. I mean, I, I, heard, I have heard some issues of them not honoring it for stupid reasons. But a couple times... The biggest complaint I hear about it is it takes months upon months upon months of getting you. They're so backlogged. And it's worse with the batteries than with the tools. If you want a battery, I hear you could wait up to six months. Um, so that's, you know, maybe a large storm for us on Friday. Oh, geez. Yeah, I haven't. I'm surprised. Well, I don't know how much snow you got, all county. We got like. If you missed it in the beginning, two and a half to maybe three inches, and um, I didn't know I didn't even have to nothing, nothing. I didn't even have to go out. You know, by the time we woke up, the sun was out. You know, a lot of it was was pretty much done. And you know, when you get two inches, by contract with me, I come two to four. Oh, you got two inches, and you were out plowing, huh? Wow. In Jersey, they don't do that for two inches. They got to pay a lot of people money for that. But um, they screwed the fork. Yeah, right? Three to five inches. But I think I'm done enough. I think like I was saying, I think there's enough snow. Logan got around five. Where are you at, Logan? Now, all counties in Long Island. I'm in northern NJ. Thank you, Kamau. You too. Oh, in Maine. Well, shit. What are you up there, Logan? You up there in Maine up chopping wood? What do you expect? We're gonna move up to Maine, start chopping wood. North of me received four to five inches. Yeah, I think they were in that three to five inch ballpark. We might have got three, you know. All right, guys, we'll talk about it some more. I wanted to get this video out. I hope everybody had a good weekend. Go Steelers! Three inches, Delaware fishermen in Delaware broke my plow. Got to fix that. Oh, Logan. Hey boss, with the Depot Oklahoma saw so, uh, five rigid kits. You said you wished you had bought. Oh, for three ninety nine. Yeah, it was two ninety nine though. Luke Loader, I wouldn't pay three ninety nine. Hey, I, I could have got it for two ninety nine. I had it in my freaking cart, man. I had it in my cart. The black rig. I, there's something about the black. I told you. A lot of you guys are like, yeah, man, me too. I had to get it. I had it, and then I'm like, what the hell am I doing? What am I doing? And I had to put it back, and I still, I sat there for like a minute, like, what should I do? I want it. I want it. But I didn't get it. Three ninety nine, no way. That automotive set, I'm going to do another video on it this week, because it's such a slamming deal. And I hope people take advantage of that. Rigid automotive combo kit. But we'll talk more. I'll be here all day. Go watch the game. Thank you, Nathaniel. You're smart. Yeah, Luke Loader was two ninety nine for around a week. Okay? Alright, God bless you people.